actually collaborate. Um, I want to talk about Wisconsin as a, microforce, as a microcosm of the forces in play in the United States, the possibilities and the barriers to uh, organizing a left response to the crisis. The right wing Republican governor of Wisconsin, that's eight minutes? Okay, so I'm going to say two things real quick. First, the governor of Wisconsin united the, the, the working class of Wisconsin by making a broad based attack on the organizations of the working class, their dignity, their capacity to organize themselves. Had the governor stuck with what every other governor has done, which was to divide, play on the divisions in the working class, he would have been successful. 37% of union households in Wisconsin voted for Walker. This, respect, this reflects a deep split in the working class between the public sector workers and private sector workers, and as well, a racially organized split between those who work and are, sent, are in the center of the economy and those people of color, immigrants, the precarious, all of whom tend to be people of color and who are marginal in the economy. Unless these two splits can be overcome, I think we will not be able to take advantage of the openings that, that um, Rick has and others have so, um, so um, well described. And I want to say that um, one of the things that we did see in Wisconsin that I think offers uh, a path out of this is that in struggle, workers moved who started out by saying, just give me my union. Their union leaderships said, we'll take all the concessions you want to give us. Just let us keep our dues base. Let us keep our union. And within a week, the workers themselves, the people of Wisconsin, the working class gathered in Madison, began chanting, tax, tax, tax the rich to pay for fully funded public services. So we can see how quickly people can move. Nonetheless, and I think this is an opening for us as an, an anti-neoliberal politics. But I want to say, along with my comrade from Germany, that the next nut we have to crack is what to do about how to reorganize the economy and deal with the threat of capital strike and the race to the bottom, which is fueling uh, the, the, the politics of this country in a very, very fundamental way. Thank you.